Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. There's a brand new center in the 2014 NBA draft as Baylor's Isaiah Austin is here to make his declaration. Uh, hello. Um, first and foremost, I would like to thank God for every opportunity that he has blessed me with in my life. And I would like to thank everybody at Baylor University for blessing me with the opportunity to be able to be welcomed into their family. And I just want to say thank you for everything that we've shared together over these past two years, memories and experiences. Uh, I'd like to thank my coaching staff for always supporting me, uh, all the doctors that have helped me, my teammates, the fans, everybody that has been on my side with this. And uh, I would just want to say that I am putting my name into the 2014 NBA draft. Uh, I feel like I am ready, and I feel like I have overcome many obstacles in my life, and I, I'm ready to take on a new challenge in my career. So I just want to say thank you to everybody, and God bless. Isaiah, why did you wait so many years um, after injuring your eye to let the public know that you're blind in your right eye? Uh, I was, it was really just fear, uh, fear of what people would think of me and, you know, people criticize people every day. And I was, I was scared of the criticism that I was going to get being a basketball player with one eye. But I'm glad that I came out with the story and I'm glad that, you know, it helps inspire people all around the world. You know, it's been one of the best decisions of my life to come out with that story. How does it make you feel that so many people say that you have inspired them since making that announcement? Uh, it's really unfathomable. Uh, it's, it's a great feeling and just the way that people have been emailing me and talking to me on Twitter and just reaching out to me and telling me that I'm an inspiration to them is just heartwarming. And I just want to say thank them. Thank you to all of, all of you who have helped me and supported me and you know we're on this ride together. Why did you come back to Baylor for your sophomore season? Uh, I felt that I wasn't mature enough. Uh, I know I had to develop a mind state that was ready for the next part of my career. And, you know, my, coming out of my freshman season, I felt like I wasn't ready. So this year I did a lot of growth both on and off the court, and I feel like I'm, I'm ready for all the obstacles that are ahead of me. What specifically do you think you learned in that sophomore season that better prepared you for the NBA? Um, specifically, uh, really just maturity and, and growth. And I've learned to love the process of getting better and becoming a better person both on and off the court. You know, uh, it's really been a, a fun ride for me here at Baylor, and it's been a tremendous opportunity for me to be able to reach out to God and, you know, just walk with my faith and be able to share that with all the students here and all the fans and people that have supported me. I just want to say thank you, and I'm, I'm ready to chase this next part of my journey. You definitely did have a wild ride uh, to the Sweet 16 with the Bears this year. Tell us about that run and what that specifically taught you about the game of basketball. Uh, that was one of the best memories I've ever had uh, playing basketball, especially sharing that with my teammates and all of our fans in Baylor Nation. You know, it's something that I'll never forget for my whole life. But, you know, playing in the Sweet 16, it has really taught me that, you know, you have to love the process of getting better and that you always have to come in with a focused mind frame because one bad game can send you home for the rest of the season. Which one of the NBA teams would you most like to play for and why? I don't have any specific team that I would like to play for, but any team that's willing to give me the opportunity to go out and work and show them that I do love the game and I'm willing to get better and I'm willing to do whatever it takes to win, I'm, I'm willing to play for that team. You know, All I need is the opportunity and I'm going to give them my all. Your mom has been like a rock to you. She's been mentioned in every story about you for the past few years. Describe the impact she's had on your life and your basketball career. I mean, my mother is my rock and Without her, I wouldn't be here today. You know, she has just put so much confidence in me and always kept me positive in any situation that I've faced in my life. And I just can't thank her enough. Each and every day, you know, she brings joy to my life. And same along with everybody else in my family. You know, they're, they're my biggest supporters, and that's why I play this game. You know, uh, I go out there and I try to give my all, all for them. And I love the game because of it. And they just keep me positive, and I can't thank them enough. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it right there via Rant Sports. Baylor's Isaiah Austin declaring for the 2014 NBA Draft. Isaiah, thanks so much for your time, and good luck at the next level, man. Thank you.